All right, welcome back. It's your boy Jay, aka the Murder Whistle. If you're looking for my co-pilots, today we are watching Hangover Part Two. I've been looking forward to this one since I watched the first one. A part of me is already sad because I know it cannot live up to the first one to me. Because I still stand by that the Hangover is the funniest thing I've ever seen in my life. I still stand by that, 100%. I've heard this one and the third one's hilarious. Well, a bunch of y'all told me in the comments this hilarious, so I'm still super excited for it. But before we get into it, I need to hit y'all. I need to hit that subscribe, bell notification, turn on the reminder. You know what I'm saying? Leave a comment. Don't forget to check out the Patreon. Over on Patreon, you get early access. To all my full of YouTube um videos, you get exclusives, and you get a vote get a vote on a poll that we do weekly. They help determine what I watch on Fridays. Don't forget to check us out on social media. Don't forget to check out the merch store. With all that being said, I'm ready to get into this. So I'll see you on the other side. Let's get it. Now, I ain't gonna lie to you. Batman's world. I thought they said it was a Batman's world. Hi, you've reached the office of Dr. Stuart Price. Is this the first? The second one starts with a win, too? Hi, this is Dr. Stu Price. I'll be out of the country for two weeks. If this is a dental emergency, please. Hey, she bad. I remember her from the real world. Hey, I'm gonna get dog. I'm gonna get dog. I'm gonna die. Bill. Tracy, I'm sorry. Where the hell are you? It happened again. Get the f up. Don't say that. Please. No, this time we really fucked up. Seriously, what is wrong with you three? So much, Trace, I don't even know where to begin. My man got bald head. How bad? Well, buzz one. Like, no wedding bad? Yeah. A little worse than that. So, who the fuck is marrying her? In your brain. I want an elephant. Was Ty Phillips the one that directed the first one? One week earlier. Fillings look pretty good. Any other problems? Yeah, actually, you're getting married in Thailand. I mean, just for starters, that's flight for me instead. Oh, he ain't way ahead of Graham? But it's where her parents are from and it means a lot to them. Who gives a shit about her parents? My dad hates you. He doesn't hate me. Nah, he looks like he hated you. He's just never spoken to me. I think it's a cultural thing. Why can't you just get married in Vegas like you did last time? Why can't you just be excited for me? Why ain't we way ahead of Graham? You're really happy, huh? I really am. I mean, you had a pre-made family. She had a baby and everything. It's going to be fun. <laughs> Bill, put the prescription pad back. That's so funny. Thank you. You know that's a felony, right? Fuck you, man. Was this right up against your scrotum? Yep. Oh, my God, I just realized. What? I forgot to renew my passport. Oh no. Good thing I did it last week. It's in the kitchen drawer. Okay. You're the best. Hey. They the ones that got married the first time. But he wasn't he wasn't one of the ones sitting on the step book, was he? Alan found out that we're going to Thailand for Stu's wedding. So? So he's heartbroken, Doug. You guys are like his family. Is he the one that keeps calling and hanging up? He does that when he's upset. He doesn't understand why he's not invited. Could you just run it by Stu? That's so funny. Just run it by him. For me. I thought Alan was one of the boys now. No fucking way. Absolutely not. Honestly, the two of you were barely invited. Oh, I get it. Damn. Well, I understand Bradley Cooper. Oh, you know what? We should see if we could squeeze the old man to cover the bachelor party. I'm glad you brought that up. 
because this is the bachelor party. What are you talking about? Yeah, it's my bachelor brunch. Whose baby is that? That ain't Bradley Cooper's baby, is it? He shouldn't have no kids. At least unsupervised. And you know what the glue is? Lauren. And I'm not doing anything to screw that up. You wouldn't even be with her if it wasn't for us. Facts. You ended up ditching Melissa, and two years later, you met your true soulmate. You take Vegas out of that equation, you would have married a cunt. He said what he said. Guys, I can't tell you how much this means. Alan's been waiting for the invite ever since he got wind of the wedding. Hey, Alan. Hey, guys. He got her right here. Pretty cool room, Alan. Oh, thanks, Phil. What the fuck? We were supposed to delete these. You made a promise. That's amazing. Wait a second. Al, is that Mr. Chow? Yeah, we still keep in touch. Chow, the guy that kidnapped us? He didn't kidnap us, he kidnapped Black Doug. Remember, it was a whole big misunderstanding. He's actually quite charming. I forgot about Black Doug. Good idea. Uh, but Alan, we have a little surprise for you. Stu would like to invite you to his wedding. Well, only if you're not busy. Stu, maybe the Jonas Brothers are in town. They're in Raleigh Durham that weekend. Mm. I bet he really knew what I was. Oh, still look at this. I bought this because I thought of you. Did they have a Kanye song in the first one? Hey, there he is. Oh, they cut my jam off. What's up? How are you? Like, I had a whole performance for that song. Who's this guy, Stu? This is Teddy, Lauren's little brother. This is Phil, Alan, and Doug. Hey, nice to meet you, man. So what, are you a doctor? No, not yet. I'm, I'm pre-med. Ever heard of that guy, Doogie Howser? Doogie Howser. Yeah? Well, he turned out to be a gay. The f***? It's true. I read it in Teen People. Well, I'm, I'm a little confused. Is he here just to see us off or what? How does this work? Is that person coming to the wedding? Yes, Alan, my bride's little brother is coming to the wedding. Is your ex-wife coming to the wedding? Mind if I sit? Wolf pack only. Find another chair. There's no wolf pack, Alan. Come on. I ain't gonna lie. I would find somewhere else to sit. I wouldn't be comfortable sitting next to him. Either it's home team or no team. But tonight. Why is he staring at him like that? Alice said the beef is real. Oh yeah, they they they're over there. I was like, why are they on the surround side of the road? But they're they're uh, they're. Oh, yeah. They'll stare at this man. You have to realize that in my country, we don't consider dentists to be real doctors. Dad. Hey, disrespect. When I first met Stu, I was not quite sold. But then I look into Stu's eyes. He reminded me of my sweet brother, Chayo. For those who do not know, Chayo is learning disabled and lives in a group home. <laughs> Shut the f*** up. Stu is Joe. Jog is soft white rice in lukewarm water. It has no taste. We feed it to small baby and uh, very old people. I mean, he called him a pasty ass white man. To my sweet daughter and Stu, congratulations. Here, here. I, hey, I'm going to tell you. I will say something. I have to. I can, I can, I can, I can not, not say nothing. I've also prepared a few words. None of you know Stu like I do. I can't even tell you what we've been through because we made a pact. More important than blood. What I can tell you is this. This is not Stu's first marriage. The f there was a whore in Las Vegas a couple of years ago. Oh, man, shut the f up. Oh, rice pudding. What are you doing? Nah. Very funny, Phil. Be nice, Phil. It's extra sensitive tonight. Get over it. He's your father-in-law. He's supposed to hate you. I'm going to tell you. If I get married, I'm just letting you know. Father-in-law, I fight. <laughs> Take Teddy with you. 
never gets to have any fun. That is a great idea. Bring the kid. All right, one drink. Perfect. See? Good. See you later. And we going to go drink. Why is he going? He's 16. My Uncle Roger said that he once saw an albino polar bear. Polar bears are white. How would he know if it's an albino? Yeah. Well, this one was black. Did you ever think maybe it was just a black bear? Whatevs. <laughs> you know, that makes sense. Whatevs. I'm actually jealous of you. I mean, Lauren is an angel. Wow, you guys are sweet. Not big breasts on her, but still solid rack for an Asian. Hey, man, shut the f up. To Lauren and Stu. You did it, buddy. Hey, Tyre Phillips love Kanye, don't he? I mean, what happened? I mean, they could have got Ruthie this time because Bradley Cooper brought the beers. The beast in me. Restless by day and by night. Yeah. I mean, these motherfuckers got a problem. Like, they need to go to some meetings. The beast in me. What the hell? Is this Johnny Cash? I actually heard a song in a chorus. This place don't look as bad as it did when the fake is, you know what I'm saying? Fake is look like it was f***ed up. I mean, it does look like a place that somebody peed in the hallway, though. I mean, look at that sweat ring. I know y'all stink. I think it's happened again. Y'all smell like alcohol and sweat. I bet money on it. Your hair is gone. No. Where are the other two? Uh, uh, Which one is that? Got the f up. Oh, holy shit. Where are we? He got a Mike Tyson tattoo? Oh my god, Alan. Your head. No, your head. Stu, you're gonna freak out, but it's gonna be okay. What's is it my teeth? Dude don't need to drink no more. Alan, what did you do? Did you root me? I didn't do anything. What happened? No! Shut up! No! Oh, what the hell? It's got a Rolling Stones jacket. Check this out. You ever seen anything like this? What are we looking at? Where is where is the little boy? Wait a second, is Teddy with you guys? Teddy, what? What are you talking about? He wasn't in his room. They've been looking for him all morning. Teddy went to Stanford, right? Yeah, why? Fuck! Shut the fuck up! I just found his finger. What? I just found his fucking finger, duck! Oh, they done fucked up. Are we gonna keep his finger? I mean, I wouldn't. What is that? What are we looking at? What is it? Is that? Fuck, man! Tell that gay monkey to leave my shit alone! Cow? That was not a baby dick. He got a baby dick. Oh, the monkey licked his dick. Oh. Don't you remember anything? No. No, motherfuckers, why were you asking? Okay. That's a big. You ready for craziest fucking story of. He just, uh, did we just watch him die? Is he dead? Mr. Chow, are you okay? Nah, he gone, folk. Fuck, he's dead. They got good drugs in Bangkok. Look, this is the worst idea ever. What the fuck is this? <laughs> that monkey cute. Come on! Oh, what? Fuck, no, the power's out. We gotta take the stairs. Oh, fuck! I'm not carrying no body down those steps. Uh. Yeah, I know it's thinking there. Not the ice place, it's everywhere they at. 
I bet it smell like hallway piss. Hallway piss and alligator elbows. I bet it does. We still have to find Teddy. The roof! Teddy! Teddy! Stay! Nah, dog. I don't think they're going to do that in the second movie. That's only first movie, bro. You tell them that Alan and I got drunk with him. We're still partying. I'm not going back without Teddy. I mean, his face red. I know it was a fresh tattoo, but damn. What happened? He got arrested. For what? Disorderly conduct. Rachawang Police Station. Hey, I'll call you when we get there. I'm not even questioning that name. 16 years old, spent a night in jail. Can you imagine? He probably loved it. Wait, who's this fucking guy? Teddy Cisai. Shut the f up. Does he look like he works out at Valley Total Fitness in Palo Alto, California? We arrest a lot of people. We cannot analyze everything. Bro, it's a picture. Do you know where our friend is? Teddy! Why are you yelling at him like that? He ain't say he said he don't talk. He ain't say he was deaf. A drink card from White Lion Bar? Worth a shot. I'm gonna tell you, my favorite parts of the movies is gonna be the retracing. Because part one when they start retracing, hey, amazing. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is the white lion. What the fuck happened here? I'ma say y'all. It's a fat one! Five ones! Definitely y'all. Whoa, 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 whoa. Guys, check it out. Stu, look! That's my face! That's my face. Hello? What is he like eight? We're trying to figure out what went down last night. You don't remember getting into a bar fight at the White Lion. Starting a full-on fucking riot. No, sir. You know. Hey, man, they are wild when they drink. I took you guys and hid you in the shop here. Then you decided to get a tattoo. Cried like a little bitch. This kid's fucking nine years old. He's got balls twice your size. Oh, he's nine. My, my bad. He's nine. Wow. So beautiful. What is this, a P.F. Chang's? P.F. Chang's. Knock, knock. Hello. Alan, Alan, some respect. Hey, Alan, don't give a f do we? Hi, how you doing? Uh, are you the one in charge? Oh! Oh! Just calm down! Ah! Hold on! Stop talking! God ah, damn it! Wait, it's me! Stop it! I know! <laughs> oh, I get it! Oh! Oh! him up! I got nothing. Alan? And he will be the one. Every memory lives somewhere deep in it. Sweetie? That's why he got that bald head. You know what I'm saying? He is one with the mo- Three, I'm a three. I know where to go. Hey, man. Is he coming or what? I've been waiting all day for him. I'm sorry, waiting for who? Ciao. Look what I bring for him. Check it out, huh? Why, why they got guns? Wow, it looks so real! Shut the f*** up. We're just looking for a little kid. Two thousand dollars. I, I... What? I don't know, I mean, maybe more, okay? How young you want this kid to be? We're not looking for that kind of kid, Mr. Kelly. Of course I remember him. This one was following me around like a little puppy dog. Saying how he fall in love with me and ask me to marry him. <laughs> I see. Hey, his man, his man's buck wild, man. We didn't get married, did we? We just have some fun in the Chardonnay room. I had to ask him to slow down, so I'm dropping my load too quick. Load? What? My sperms. Shut the f*** up. Where would your sperm come from? From my balls. I, are you... Hey. Shut the f*** up. You in Bangkok, sweetie. There's a reason they don't call it Bang Con. Oh! I guess it's key to the plot. I don't get it. Is this a magic show? We climax at the same time. How does that work? Shoot my load into you, shoot your load on the floor. Okay. Yeah, you're loading at me. My bottom. Oh, God! Oh, she gave you a dirty Twinkie. Oh! 
Sue, so, it's not the end of the world. I am so confused. I made love to a man. <laughs> But we just ran out about it. And then we forget. That's what we do. Oh, God. You just forget. It goes away. That might be harder to go away, but in time it'll happen. <laughs> oh, that is great. Get your head back into the fucking game, Stu. Uh, you got a dirty Twinkie. Uh... I'm going to tell you something that you did not know. I don't like you. No shit. If my daughter chooses you, that's this is her mom. Hey, it's Phil. Hey, you know what? I I appreciate you dropping oh, that nice. bomb. On you. Oh, 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 oh. God, don't. You must fuck out a monkey. Get your own monkey. No one's getting shot over a fucking monkey. Hand him over now. I get shot over a monkey. Oh, they got the little monkey helmet. You know where her friend is? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 16 years old. What do you say? Fuck you and your questions. Oh. Oh, they're having a horrible go this time. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> I don't know. Let me look. Let me look. Ah! What? Ah! Hey. Yo. You all right? Yeah. Bullet just grazed my arm. Hey, did he um did he have to go to the hospital in the first one too? I'm sorry guys, this wasn't part of the plan. What plan, Alan? I've said too much already. Shut the f up. I had a separate bag just for Teddy, but it was dark and it was hard to keep track. Shut the f up, he rooted these marshmallows. Look at my face! You ruined my life! Hey, hey, like, listen, I've I've had a muscle relaxer before. I've never done that shit. Does the 88 graders make you do that, too? You're the bearded devil! You smiled at me when I held up the bag of marshmallows. Fucking psycho! Oh, hey, dude, why? Those were the three best friends, remember? Nah, no, you, you, you're not in that circle no more. You've been doing too much. You know what I'm saying? We got to kick you out the club, baby. Ella, what's that written on your belly? What? The Bua Hotel. Did you write that? No. Who writes a note right there? Here you go. Shut the f up. They got the rhino in this bitch. Take off your fucking hat. You're in a restaurant for Christ's sake. Come on. I'm a little confused. How did you. Yeah, you know what? I'm a little fucking confused. Where is Chow with the fucking account code and the fucking password? I mean, how you gonna say, you know what I'm saying? I'll take my hat off, we're in a restaurant, you will cuss me out like Gordon Ramsay and We're just trying to find our friend. Hmm. There's Teddy. Oh. Where's Teddy? I have invested a large chunk of capital in your friend Chow. We took Teddy as insurance. Oh my god! Shut the f up. Is he okay? Oh my god, I wasn't done talking. Now, if he makes the transfer, you will get Teddy. If not, well then, hey, you know, it's Bangkok. I don't, I don't never want to go to Bangkok. We go anywhere else in the United States a party like this. Hey, you know what? Leave the hat. I ain't getting no dirty Twinkie, though. Guy doesn't give a shit about Chow's, too. This whole thing's about a fucking bank account. First the monkey, now my hat. What's the worst can this day get? Hey, man. <laughs> I love the fact he focused on the wrong shit. We got beaten by a monk. That monk was on y'all's ass. I was happy and my life was good. You know what? If you married motherfucker Heather Graham again, you would have been in Bangkok. Get this shit happen. You would have been. I got fucked in the ass by a girl with a dick. <laughs> I remember that. Hey, man. He sung that 
like wasn't that wrong with it. Like it was like it was a a normal song. Shut the fuck up. Feeling better? You warm enough? I don't know. Come feel my balls and tell me. You don't have to kill me. Ciao. Nobody killed you. I mean, you killed yourself, bro. Oh, you're having a bad day? Did you die? I got shot. But did you die? <laughs> but did you die? <laughs> oh. Where's the monkey? Monkey. Is that your account number and password in his vest? Where is he? Ugh. Oh, the monkey gone. That little monkey snorting coke me all night, jerking me off while I watch through, make fuck with Lady Boy. Did he say the monkey be jerking him off? Is that what he said? Did he say the monkey be jerking him off? This monkey isn't just normal monkey. I'm your mother, I'm your daddy. Yeah. I'm your friend, your main boy, the I'm your pussy man. He take coke to buyer uh, and deliver cash to dealer. They ain't a fast and furious. That's terrible. Not terrible. What you talking about? Fucking genius. You ever see Monkey go to jail? Hey, you know. <sighs> Stu, Mr. Child Cat Whistle. Signal Monkey. I came with Sweetie. Hey, I, I can't lie. My inner kid is like Alan right now. Did we steal him again? Hey, the monkey snitching. Who that fucking monkey is? Oh! Hey, where are you gonna shoot the monkey? <laughs> hey, Mr. Child's whooping that bitch, ain't he? Hold on, gay boy! Was open when that happened. They shot the monkey. Shut the f up. Oh no. What? Oh no. Shut the f up. Oh, the monkey ain't dead. I have such an erection right now. I mean, your dick look like a mushroom. So you really do you have an erection? They can take good care of you here, okay? They gonna cook that monkey. You ever do anything that doesn't end up in a standoff, Chow? I'm an international criminal. It always ends like this. Got the f*** up. I love Chow. Password? Baloney1. My baloney has a first name. <laughs> See? We go to your wedding, we have fun, I bust a nut. <laughs> we go to your wedding, we have fun, I bust a nut. Shut the f*** up. Detective Inspector Peters, Interpol. When Samir told us that your friend was lost, we took advantage of that information. I'm sorry. Shut the f*** up. They don't have him. They never had him. They just needed us to bring them chow. They used Teddy as bait. Oh, these motherfuckers dirty. If you haven't found him by now, I'm afraid Bangkok has him. What the f*** does that mean? I'm sorry. And okay, this is where we found our boy last time. A little worse than that. I mean, I know they f***ed up and shit, like we looking for a whole nother person, but that's a beautiful view. Okay, I got it. Teddy was hit by a truck. His body was too mangled to recover. Case closed. I mean, how you gonna show up with talking about? I'm not gonna lie to Lauren. Do. You need to. Look at what I've done, Phil. What I do. Now, now you should definitely lie about this. I want you to call Doug. Tell him I'm never coming back. And stay here in Bangkok. Open up a little dentist office. Teeth cleanings with a happy ending. Hey. They might be out of something. 
Hey! Power's out, Alan. Phil? Tell me what's going on right now. We lost your little brother. Bangkok has her now. Bangkok has her now. You gotta take the stairs. Oh, he's remembering. I love you so much. And, and, and I gotta go, but I'll see you soon. Bye. What the f are you? Taxi! Taxi! Come on! And I bet the taxis think too. I bet it smells like old potatoes. Teddy got ice from the machine, came back to the room, put his finger on ice, fell asleep. On the 15th fucking floor! Yes! He on an elevator? You okay, man? <laughs> but we're gonna get you out of here, it's gonna be fine. But well, what about a figure? We can still pull this off! How do we a taxi? Chow's speedboat. Chow has a speedboat? The perfect life. Come on. Well, he did say boat. I was raised in yacht clubs. I know what I'm doing. I wouldn't let him drive. Do you have any idea where my finger is? Yeah, we gave it to a drug dealing monkey. Bangkok. Yeah, right? Shut the f up. <laughs> I, I, I missed that part. I didn't realize they gave it to a monkey. That would be no wedding. Oh, he is on his way. He will be here. If you will all move to the bar, we are going to clear this area. His dad, her dad is an asshole. Still! And it's great as ever. Alan, there's no doubt. Just hang on. Alan, it's not funny. Turn the boat. Is that Alan driving the boat? It is. Everyone back up a little bit here. Sir, it's gonna get worse before it gets better. I would've told him to kill. Ah! Hey, you can't pull up to your wedding any better than that. Came in a little hotter than we planned. A little bit of sod will be fine. Baby! Ah, oh, so happy to see you. This motherfucker threw the anchor out. This is your fault. No, Dad. He's right. Phil? Yeah? Don't do this. Thanks, Phil, but gonna do it. Here's the deal, man. I got a dark side. There's a demon in me. It's true, he has semen in him. <laughs> I said demon. But you also have semen in you, remember? It's not relevant, but thank you, Alan. Listen. Alan, bro, you can't, you can't, we talking, with it. we talking, bro. You gotta get in the back. I love your daughter. And I'm gonna marry her. Unless you have any problem with that. I'm good. All right. <laughs> And she was cool with the tattoo on his face. It would actually mean a great deal to both of us if we could just get your motherfucking blessing. Shut the f up. Well, me and him would have got along and I cussed him out a long time ago. Take good care of my daughter, Stu. I will. My man cleaned up with the tattoo, though. Dear family and friends, on behalf of Stu and Lauren, I welcome all of you. Look at, look at Allie. Look at Allie. Look at Allie. Can you hold on for a second. Thank you. <clears throat> oh Lord. Hi everyone. I'm. Uh, my name is Alan. I want to thank the Asiatic people for allowing us in your land. Asiatic yeah, people. I have a wedding gift to present to Lauren and Stu, and I hope that you appreciate it as much as I did, are going to. Are going to. He talk like me. Bangkok, Orient City, the city don't know what the city is. Shut the f up. Hey, they got Mike Tyson in this bitch. And he's singing. One night in Bangkok makes the hard man humble. What is he saying? I, I got some of it. I ain't get all of it. Hey, guys. You're not going to believe this. Is that your phone? But I recharged it and found all these photos. What? Shut the f up. Awesome, let's check them out. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, Tyson, like me, I'm ready to look. We look at it once. And then we delete them. It's gonna be okay. Oh! Motherfucker. <laughs> Damn, he is f***ed up. Hey, man. 
That's how you got to know that. The monk wasn't doing coke. Did she shoot a pink ball at her pussy? Don't believe me, just watch and see. Beast. I'm an animal. Oh, he cut his own finger off. That's fucking hilarious. Hey, man, I love these movies, man. All right. So, we just got finished watching Hango Part 2. I love that movie. But I was correct. It's not as... It's funny. It is funny. It's funny as hell. Do not get me wrong. It is funny as hell. It's not laugh out loud funny as the first one. It is still hilarious. Like, I will still watch this motherfucker on repeat. But as of right now, I'll hang, a, hang over one and two marathon. I still love everybody's chemistry in the movie. First, I love the way Alan's stepdad disrespected him. I mean, I want to take the shit, but I love it. No, his name ain't Alan. His name is Stu. 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 I'm fucking tripping. Stu. I love how old girl just... Didn't bat an eye that he had a tattoo on his face. Only she was like, well, let's change jobs right now. But she was cool with it. She's like, all right. So you came back with a tattoo and my brother lost a finger. We still getting married. I can't believe my man got a dirty Twinkie. I can't believe the monkey. And, and did he say the monkey be jacking him off? Did he say that? Because I, like, because I may have to have my headphones down a little bit lower. Is that what he said? Because, you know what I'm saying? We need to call Peter or somebody. I love the fact they got their ass whooped by a monk. I love the fact that Alan told them, oh, he's got married to, a, this is not his first marriage. He got married to a whore in Las Vegas. Like I said, I enjoyed the hell out of this. I do look forward to the third one. Mike Tyson came out singing. I don't know what he said. I know some of the stuff he said. And I know Smack thought like he got his nerves. I you, you're right. I do. I do. But I'm just saying. I need y'all to hit that like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to check out the Patreon. Give a shout out to the VIPs. Give a shout out to Leslie, Trey, John Harold, Becca June, the beautiful dog Missy, Big Al Robin, Big Frank, Cody Stoudemire, Paul Swicky, Frost nineteen ninety seven, Anna Rondo, Jeff Jernigan. Adam, Grady B. Olsen, Red Tail Z, TJ Gingler, Thomas, the Brandis, what is it, baby? Garrett, Elizabeth Esposito, Nicholas Jenkins, Super Nobody, Rachel Martinez, Jennifer Natley, BB98, Chris, Nareen, Nick, Coke Movies at Midnight, Jamie Gibson, Miguel Brooks, Caleb, Steve McClusso, Echo, Peanut, Sammy, Zachary, Jonathan Patrick, Ron, Rocket, Beardo, Blackbeard, Bob, Hot Indie Media, I'm in Lock, Jake Stimson, Banan Boar, Jake Slogan, Tony A. Aragon, Catherine Roberts, Dom, LeVar Hawkins, Show, Colin LaShore, Jason, Harley Smith, Brad Williams, Rick, Miranda, Michael, Jesse Montoya, Gina, Luke the First, and Antoinette. Thank y'all for being VIPs. I want to thank everybody else for being part of the family as well. Um, tell y'all the time. Y'all are the best part of this channel. I'm going to get off here. So y'all be good. Y'all be safe. Night, night.